guys, welcome to Rant to Chill. On this channel, I like to rant and I like to chill. You're gonna be chilling asking the question, what is the most underrated baby metal song? In your opinion, of course. Now I've asked this question before. We're asking it again. We're gonna explore it this time using the subreddit. I noticed the question popped off over there. Shout out to the baby metal subreddit. I I definitely enjoy uh look around over there and their the questions very interesting very very engaging um the shout out to the poster of uh, the person who posted this um ps underscore f o t n m c that's ps underscore f o t n m c i think i, I think uh, the mic didn't pick the rest, but anyway, so the title was what's their most underrated song. So let me know in the comment section, what you think is the most underrated baby metal song now, but pause real fast because are you sure? Are you sure the song you have in mind is the most underrated song? First, let's take a look at what the Reddit had to say. Uh, these are the posts. So. Uh, Juiceless Mango says brand new day. It says it's criminally, it's uh, only been played live a few times. Hmm. Brand new day. Now that is a catchy tune. But is it? Is it underrated? After all, Metal Galaxy was a very successful album though that doesn't necessarily mean brand new day is under is is overrated or or is uh, all that well known it might be the it might be the song in that album that's often skipped but what do you think about that and there's some support there uh, I see that the person uh juiceless mango has some support with that Though there's some disagreement with that as well. Um, let's see what else. What other recommendations or other suggestions here? Yuki Yuki Midnight. Yuki Yuki Midnight. I have to agree with that. That is a good uh, contender for most underrated song, most underrated baby metal song. Yuki Yuki Midnight. It is so underrated for me. I often forget about that song. But it has a very interesting atmosphere, that song. And there's an interesting vibe to it. I think it's kind of has some horror undertones to it. Like some creepy pasta horror undertones. Especially when you watch them perform it live and the choreography where it looks like they're kind of like zombified and whatever. Uh, like they're being uh, moved around by like a puppet master or something. Uh, very strange. But the lyrics kind of convey a different sort of thing. But anyway, so Yuki Yuki Midnight. Do you guys think that's an, a very underrated baby metal song? No. That's not the question, though, is it? The question is, what is the most? So you might say, yes, it's a very underrated baby metal song. But is it the most underrated song? Well. What about From Dusk Till Dawn? From Dusk Till Dawn. Now, this one often comes up as a favorite. I've seen this voted on many times in polls. So, I don't know if From Dusk Till Dawn is even overrated, or sorry, underrated at all. It's not overrated for sure. But it's not underrated either. I think... More people know about From Dust Till Dawn than Yuki Yuki Midnight. In fact, I would say From Dust Till Dawn gets more attention than even Brand New Day. So, I would have to say it is not the most over uh, underrated. Why keep on saying over overrated? No, that that could be another another video. What is the most overrated song? <laughs> we'll save that one for later, guys. Um, let's see. Any other things that really pop up? Oh, up, down, left, right, B, B, A, B. Okay. All right. Has this song ever been performed live? I don't think so, has it? 
Up, down, left, right, B, B, A, B. It's not even my favorite Bay Metal track. It, it's it's not... I, I prefer BMC. BMC is... Is a good track. I like BMC. It's it's been performed live too. There's a music video for it. Up, down, left, right, B, B, A, B might actually be the most underrated baby metal song. In fact, you probably forgot about it. You probably didn't even remember that song existed until today uh, watching this video, listening to me talk. Congratulations. You were reminded that that is a song. Let's see. Any other suggestions here? Uh, more Yuki Yuki Midnight. That definitely is getting a lot of attention. There is a reference here to Kimi to anime guy uh, Mitai. I'm not even sure what that is. It's a cover song. I think they've done that like once, right? I, it, but that's that's not a baby metal song. It's a cover song. So like I, uh, if you if you consider that a baby metal song, then sure, fine. Whatever that was, the Kimi Two Anime Guy, uh, 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 Mitai, sure, yeah, that that is that would probably be the most underrated if you want to include that. But it's a cover song. Come on, we're not including that. Um, there's more. Uh, more calls for from Dust Till Dawn, but like I said, I think uh, more people know about that song than y- Yuki Yuki Midnight, Our Brand New Day. Um, let's see. Tells of the Destinies. That is, hmm, that one does get forgotten. It's really good. Uh, there's some nice progressive elements in that song. That's some nice dynamic changes to it. It really stands out as something very unique. But is it the most underrated compared to up, down, left, right, B, B, A, B? I would have to say no. Though it is a contender. Uh, more calls for brand new day. Someone actually mentioned night night burn. Mm. I think I think those are underrated songs, but not the most underrated. Uh, someone mentioned Elevator Girl. That's not underrated. Elevator Girl is not underrated. Um, it's not overrated, but it's not underrated either. Um, let's see. Do do do. Any others? Someone mentioned Starlight. I think Starlight is good where it is. I don't think it's underrated. I don't think Starlight is underrated. Um, and then someone mentioned Kaguru. Kaguru is an amazing song. I love that song. It, I don't think Kaguru does not get the play that it should. It, it deserves more. Uh, it deserves more. Uh, attention. I, I really like it. I think it's really cool. But I don't think it's underrated. And having seen this stuff, someone mentioned Yava. Is Yava underrated? Oh, man, Yava's one of my favorite tracks. Yava is great, man. Awadama Fever and Yava. Man, those are some good tracks. Hmm. Uh, Syncopation. I don't think that's underrated either. Compare, because you got to think, compared to what? Compared to the other songs, the ones that people just don't know about, like Up, Down, Left, Right, B, B, A, B, maybe Matatoro. Maybe GJ. Tracks that people kind of forget about. Now, we went over this in the subreddit. They mentioned some interesting things. Uh, Interesting suggestions. What do you think? What do you think? Having, Having heard these suggestions, does it change your mind with the most underrated Bay metal track is or is it the same has your answer been unchanged having uh, seen that post though and read through it I'd have to say I have to agree up down left right BBAB might be the most underrated track 
But maybe I'm confusing that with the track I just like the least because it's the same. I would say in that in the area might be tracks like Anadori Daisukusen. That's underrated. Maybe Song 4, underrated. Um, yeah. I think that... I think those would be it. Or maybe In the Name Of. That's an underrated track. It, do you agree? Hmm. But the most underrated? Yeah, I'll have to go down with up, down, left, right, BBAP. Most underrated. It's like forgotten. They don't even play it live. It was like, what's the point? What's the point of even making that song? You, have they played it live one time? Anywhere? Let me know. With that said, you let me know what you think is the most underrated Babe Metal song. You guys take it easy and have a good one.